Now, from your hyperlocal weather source, this is your Norcast weather update. Brought to you by Angelic Health. Is it more than forgetfulness? Are you concerned about caring for someone with memory loss? The Angelic Health Memory Care Program provides unique services for both patient and loved ones and is covered by insurance. www.angelic.health. Hi, everybody. Meteorologist Brittany Trumpy here. I hope you are enjoying your Sunday morning so far. A lot of the times we like to talk about our dominant weather feature or our uh, next weather maker. For us this week, our big story is going to be a big trough just dropping over the U.S. It's going to bring some very cold air to our area. It's going to help to give us a little bit of an opportunity for some snow showers Monday into Tuesday. But really, I think the big impact is going to be the colder temperatures. So today we are back into the low, maybe mid 40s. That is above average. Tomorrow we're back close to where we're supposed to be. But check out Wednesday. Temperatures could be kind of struggling to get out of the 20s and into the 30s as the bulk of that cold air kind of arrives on our doorstep. The rest of the day today, though, not half bad. We're staying in the 40s all the way through till maybe that 3, 4 o'clock time frame, and then we are back down into uh, the 20s overnight tonight, so some cold air on the way. Here's a look at this setup. So we are seeing that trough kind of dig down over the U.S. You see that band of uh, blue shading kind of stretching back towards uh, almost Texas where it turns into purple and then it kind of moves back towards North Carolina through uh, Tennessee and Kansas. So that's the bottom of the trough right there. That acts as a conveyor belt, helps to pull a lot of that Gulf moisture up along that leading edge, and it will kind of pull that snow up towards our area. So you can kind of see that snow kind of slowly working its way through uh, central PA, a couple of flurries kind of stretching towards New Jersey, and then there's a little bit of a, a rain on rain event on the back end Tuesday morning. So there's two different scenarios that we're keeping a very close eye on. This is scenario A, or the number one scenario, uh, not to say that number one is better than number two, but this is optional. Option A, you see kind of things transition into rain on the south end of that kind of leading boundary, and it leads to really no accumulation for South Jersey. An alternative option, option B, would be that the rain kind of stays a little bit further off the coast, further to the south, and you wake up Tuesday morning and South Jersey has a cute little dusting of snow, maybe one to two inches. We're going to keep an eye on it either way, uh, but you'll see a couple of flurries if you're out late Monday into Tuesday. Uh, but either way, just not going to pack too much of a punch as far as the snow chances. Now the temperatures, that's another story. That's uh, that's going to pack quite the punch uh, with uh, some drastic cool downs on the way. Looking forward to tomorrow, a mix of clouds and sun, but really on the cloudier side overall as that moisture kind of starts to move in. And then the rest of the week looks pretty quiet. There's one more chance for some uh, wintry mix on the way for Friday, but the temperatures kind of pick up a little bit in that time frame, so it does look to be a little bit messier. I just still don't think that there's much uh, opportunity for accumulation or winter wonderland or anything like that but at least we'll see a couple of flurries possibly overnight monday into very early tuesday so if you're a night owl or if you're up kind of early you might be one of the few who get to see a quick little dusting of snow before it gets washed away or really at all before it sticks to anything overall in the this week ahead not half bad it will be cold but we do have some nice stretches in there that are quiet and we are not seeing any really big rain makers which is a good thing because we definitely do not need any rain Okay, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your afternoon. I'll be checking in with you in just a couple of hours.